welcome back to my channel if you're returning thank you for supporting me and if you're new here welcome let's get down to the nitty gritty we can see the end of the tunnel we can see the clubs the pubs the restaurants the festivals the holidays the shops the normality is slowly coming back so today i thought i would do a out of lockdown try on haul because why not summer's on its way the news seems to be getting positive some days so i went on to misguided this is not paid for or gifted i bought all these clothes myself i actually had to send like a massive bag back because i was like okay hon you've gone too far here or they didn't fit or they didn't suit me. So I went on, ordered so many lovely outfits and I thought I would show you and give you some ideas and let's get ready for the out of lockdown, fingers crossed summer. Okay, so first we've got this long sleeved ribbed, I would say it's like in between a nude and a mustard colored dress. I just feel like this is perfect for before we're getting red hot, but still a bit chilly. So we need a bit of long sleeved, but the sun is shining. For a lunch with your friends or like a nice walk or well, basically i wear i'd wear this for chilling in the house i'm not gonna lie but this is really cute this is a size 10 it's a really stretchy material as you can see yeah this is super cute the next i went for these wet look trousers i actually these are size 12 but i could have probably gone a 10 like i love them but they're a little bit baggy around the ankle so i wanted them literally stuck to me like spray paint um and then i went for just this little crop top which i'll show you in a minute it does come with a skirt but i've just had some trainers and a little black bag and i just thought even though it's not summery i just think if i was going into town for lunch this would be a perfect go-to outfit and i just wanted some nice i've got another pair of wet look leggings from another company and they're really nice as well but they're flared and i wanted some tight ones so i do like this outfit not my favorite outfit but i will definitely be wearing this for a nice lunch or i change to some little black heels and maybe even wear this going out dr having a drink but this is a cute outfit So this was a complete accidental buy but I ended up really liking it so basically I wanted a black tie crop top which is this one here to go with the wet look leggings that I just showed you and it came I was like what is this because I could only see the skirt opened it up and it was a set and it wasn't really that expensive at all like obviously I'll put all the links in uh, and this outfit is in a size 10 and I just think it's, it's quite flattering I think it's showing that bit of leg Normally I wouldn't probably go for something like this as a skirt, but I really, really like it. I think it's really cute. And I've just styled it with some little black heels. But I can definitely see myself wearing this to in the beer garden in the nice sunshine with a bit of leg out. Okay, I know it looks like there's a black theme going on, but I promise it's a bit more nudes come into it there isn't much color but more nudes come into it it's not so dark but i think this is so cute i said my mom like i always do this i always send her the things i'm buying and get her opinion because i know as soon as mom says she doesn't like it it completely puts me off and i just want to send it back and this was her favorite one like i think it's because there's not a lot of skin showing by leg um but i do really like this i think it's very cute i think it's really flattering this is a size 10 and it is i think with my boobs i could have got i should have really gone a 12 but like the length of it is fine and it does fit i just have a bigger bust like i never know during this line here with these dresses i never know if my boobs are meant to be here like above that line but that means no dress would probably fit me because yeah my bust does not live up there unfortunately anymore but i just styled this with some docks i feel like i kind of look like a punk rock girl it kind of like i don't know what vibe i would cast this as but i love this vibe at the minute i think it looks really cool and i can just see myself with a with a nice drink in the sunshine 
with my friends. I just feel like I can see myself in a beer garden with a nice alcohol free Koppenberg because obviously 265 days no alcohol this year if you watched my new year's resolution video if you haven't go check it out there's some really good and fun resolutions on there and really interesting to hear what other people's are but I've just styled this with obviously a white I don't even know what these are called cut like a corset top I, I had this exact one and sold it and then I've rebought it because I actually did really like it and I don't know why I sold it. Someone made a really funny comment about it not suiting me so I sold it and then I was like hon oh, I don't care what you think so I bought it back um, with a little handbag and some see-through heels. This outfit is a bit of me like I actually love it like I feel really confident like I've got my fake tan on and my nails painted and I've dressed how I would dress to go for cocktails and I got nowhere to go which is a bit sad but we in a pandemic it's okay I'm just showing you guys what we can wear when we're out of this but yeah I love this outfit I think this is really a flattering outfit okay this try on I feel like every outfit I try on I end up loving more and more than the one before so this one is obviously the top that I just wore before and I've just got it with a blazer and shorts set. Just make sure my, my zipper's up. Um, I just feel like this is perfect for a lunch or cocktails. Like I am excited to wear this outfit. The first person to say I need an iron. Hon, I know. I just haven't got time to iron it before I do this video because I have got a very busy mum life and I really want to show you all this one because I feel like this is so flattering. I feel like a blazer set always is. And I got these shorts thinking, oh, are they going to fit? Like, is the material going to be stretchy? But it's not stretchy, but it, they fit perfect. They're really lovely. I just think the colour is really flattering too. And obviously I've just styled it with some see-through pointed heels and a little bag. Oh, I just want to go out now. I feel like try on hauls just make me want to go out. I feel like this outfit you could probably even put with like some nice cute trainers or some sandals and it'd still look pretty classy. Okay, I know I have already shown you this top, these trousers, separate outfits, but I thought I would just put them on together. I feel like now, because my outfit before was really dark, this just makes it feel a bit brighter with a nice white fresh top. And I put some heels on with it as well, because now I feel like this outfit went from like a lunch to now going out, like for a nice drink. Like honestly, I am sorted now for the next 10 times I go out, but I don't go out that often, so that would be like nearly a whole year of times. But yeah, this is a cute outfit. I feel like these styled together look really nice as well. Sorry if I'm boring you wearing the same outfit or are you fed up with just seeing this white top? <laughs> okay, so this one, I can't decide if I love it or it just doesn't suit me. I actually did get it in a blue as well and the blue was so nice, but... The blue was a 12, but this is a 10. And the blue just seemed really big. Like this one seems still like I could have definitely gone for an eight and I'm not an eight, but I could have definitely because basically it's got these ruched sides and you pick your like length. So if I undid that, obviously I wouldn't wear it like that. And then you can either pull both sides and tie them. But I kind of like the one side. I feel like that's how I would probably wear it. And then you just do that. And yeah, I just don't know how I feel about the collar either. Like, I don't know if I, I don't know if it's me. And I've just styled it just with some white trainers. I was going to go for heels, but I don't think it is a heel dress. So with the collar and the long sleeves and it being quite baggy, I don't think I'd wear this as a going out outfit. This would be beer garden lunch outfit. Also, for the length I want, this touches the ground, which I don't know if that would really upset me if this got filthy. Um... But yeah, I feel like it was it wasn't my favourite, but I like it. I think it is in it was in my like maybe pile when I was sending things back. But the more I'm wearing it and the more I'm looking in the mirror, I am starting to like it a lot more. The colour does it for me. I love this colour, it goes with everything. It's just like people would say that's so plain colour, but I think a nude, you can't go wrong with a nude at all. This 
one. I literally only bought it because it's got a butterfly on it. Like I am obsessed with butterflies at the minute. Like one sec. Like even my phone case has butterflies on. Like I am butterfly mad. I don't know what it is. I feel like they're quite, they're just such a beautiful creature. And also they just remind me of like my family that I've lost. Like when I see a butterfly, I think of them. So I do love butterflies. Antisocial butterfly, love it. This didn't come with it. So this is a beltless top. It's just like a baggy, long white top. But I think it definitely needs a belt so that you can actually see a waist. But I don't like the buckle on this one for this outfit. But I think a nice black belt to pull it in and show your waist would look nice. I think it is clean, fresh, summery. Simple. You can wear it in the house, out the house. It's quite a chill wear top. Like you wouldn't be going... Like, no offence ever anyone has, but I wouldn't be going to the club wearing this, if that makes sense. Um, it's definitely more of, like, going for a nice walk at your local, like, park. If you're from Nottingham, you'll know Woolerton Park. I'd wear this to Woolerton Park. And I've just styled this with some black trainers, because obviously with the black rack, I think that goes well together. Now, this is one of my favourites. I absolutely love this. I've obviously styled it with some Doc Martens, because I feel like this dress is just a bit of me, bit of leopard print, bit of rouge. I think it just looks so cute and flattering. Like it fits my waist perfectly. Like it's not a flat dress. It definitely fits nice. I love it. I love the fact that, same again, I love this idea. Maybe it's, maybe I've been living in a rock. I've had loads of rouge dresses before, but I've never seen them that you can actually change it yourself. So obviously you can wear it without the rouge, but yeah, sorry Huns. Bit of leg out, it's for me. It's for me. So I can see myself again. I'd love to say with the gin and tonic, but more like a tonic and lemonade. I used to hate, when I say hate, I'm not exaggerating, hated gin and tonic. I thought tonic water was the most minging thing in the world. And tonic and gin are probably your most healthiest drink, unless you're literally down in straight vodka. Um, so I made myself learn to like it because I just feel like I drank so much Prosecco, so much wine, vodka, coke, full fat, like two years ago, that I just felt like that was definitely one of my weight gains. Even though I didn't go out very often, but when I went out, I went out, let my hair down. So I'm really, I'm missing a G&T right now. So when I'm in the beer gardens, it'll just be a tonic um, with a bit of lemon, it seems. But this outfit is perfect. I may not be able to get drunk or have a drink but at least i can look cute that's what it's all about okay this outfit makes me look forward to summer so bad like i'm not even this outfit makes me not look forward to the pub just to be able to have my doors open wear skirts get my legs out <sighs> The countdown is on. Actually, the weather today has literally chucked it down sun, chucked it down sun, chucked it down. Currently don't know what it's like out there, but it's probably not great. But I love this outfit. So this is all misguided. Obviously the belt and the shoes on. But we've got this shirt with puffy sleeves. Obsessed with this, sent my photo. She wanted it straight away. Um, so I can guarantee she'll try and steal this one off me. Um, then just a nice, so I don't really wear denim skirts because I just felt, like i wasn't comfortable with my weight in a denim skirt if that makes sense i don't think they flattered me very well but with my weight loss i feel like it just i don't know i feel more comfortable and confident in them and then this is just a bodysuit what i love about this guy so this bodysuit is do you know underneath the clips just having that little bit of extra to be able to actually clip them without having my leg in the air and having someone help me is brilliant so 10 out of 10 for that misguided the play suit fastened up uh, the jumpsuit the bodysuit, sorry, fastened up very easy. Love that. I just feel like this outfit is so cute and I feel comfortable. I feel like ready for summer and happy. And yeah, this is a cool outfit. And I've just started with some brown tie sandals. I just feel holiday ready. Sunshine, come to me. I love this outfit. So this was definitely like my second favourite outfit. With it being, I don't know, cute, summery. I feel confident in it. Um... It's not all black and dark, so I saved the la the best till last, and I can't wait for you to see the last outfit. But this is my second favorite outfit. Okay, and finally.
finally, last but not least, if you know me, I absolutely, I'm actually obsessed actually with ruche dresses. I just think they really complement my body. I love these fluffy puffy sleeves. I just think this dress, these this style dress just really suits me. Obviously I've got my little mum tum under there and I just feel ruched dresses just really flatten my body shape and kind of cover them lumps and bumps. But even if we are in lockdown, I will be wearing this dress for my birthday, whether I'm sat on the sofa or out and about. This is my birthday dress. I love the colour, I love the style. It's a bit of me. I like a lot of these outfits. So this is definitely my favourite outfit by far. I just feel like, I just feel sexy in it. Let's be honest, I just feel good, I feel sexy. Just got a little bag and some see-through pointed heels again. I also really like the neckline that is square. I feel like this is really flattering shape on my chest as well. Thank you so much for watching my video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Any comments for any other ideas for YouTube, please comment below. And thank you for always supporting me. Lots of love.